standing up doing the right thing. Yes, right. Are y'all listening to me say? Yes, so in this way, you will be persecuted. Amen. Come on, read it. You are the salt of the earth. Now, this is what we want to get to before we finish here. We are the salt of the earth. We are the salt. Amen. Yes, we are. Hallelujah. We are the salt. Yes, Lord. Now, if it's not talking about us, who is it talking to? Amen. Amen. What we heard today, amen, the Bible said, it is, you know, what we heard today is salt. Amen. It's yes, the word of truth to, yes, to build is. us up, to make us what the Father want us to be. That's right. right. To live the life that the Father want us to live. There's many people that will live their life in this flesh. They will live it in vain because they did the wrong thing while they was within it. That's Amen. right. Yes, Lord. yes, Lord. They allow the world to shape them to be what they are today. Amen. But we are them that are led by the Spirit of God. Whatever the Spirit tells us, that's what we find ourselves doing. That's right. When the Spirit says, it's a shame for a man to have long hair, immediately I cut it off. I didn't, I didn't care what people said about that's me. Right. That's right. People said I was a fool for doing all that. Yeah. When I heard the word about giving up dancing, I gave that up too. Amen. Right. And those that heard about it, they said I was crazy. They weren't thinking about my soul, they were thinking about themselves. Amen. Because if I would have made it to the top, right. they knew they would have got part of it. Yes, sir. Man. Then they looked at the church and said, hey, that's a cult that you mean. Right. Because it, it turned me from sin to the truth. Amen. 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 Right. And I would tell people, because they say, I just can't see how you just give up dancing. I try to be like you. Then I said, then learn from me. If dancing was the answer, I would be still dancing. Amen. 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 That's right. Amen. 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 Evidently, I must receive something that is far more greater. Oh, yeah. Four more precious than dancing in fame. That's right. That's right. Are y'all listening to me? Amen. Amen. The thing I need is in your shoe. Yes, I don't need these pagan customs no more. Amen. To give me joy. Yeah. I don't need nothing like that to give to somebody. I don't need none of these things anymore. I don't need nothing that is false and artificial. Right. Give me the real thing. That's right. Give me what's right. That's what I'm right. going about. Hallelujah. If you don't do it, I'm going to do it. Yes. That's right. Amen. You don't believe, that's your problem. That's right. But, I, I, but I've learned not to learn. The, I've been taught by the Spirit. I'm not going to learn the ways of the heathen. That's Amen. true. Okay, I'm bad my flesh want to do it. Right. Not going to do it. But it's not going to do it because I control right. it. Yes. Amen. Are y'all listening to me? Amen. Come on, finish it now. You are the salt of the earth. Say, you are the salt of the earth. But if the salt. Now, if you ain't going to stand up and do the right thing, have lost this Savior. if you're not going to stand up and do the right thing, yes. if the salt has lost its savor, wherewith shall it be salt? Then how in the world, how in the, how in the your kinfolk, yes. your neighbors whom you say you're concerned about, how is it, amen, the people on your job going to know the truth if yes. you won't stand up and do what's right to do? Right. Amen. Now, you tell me how they're going to learn. Yes. Amen. If you don't stand up yes. and do the right thing, how is that? How will they be salty? Amen. Amen. You stop and think about that. Yes. You that sit this, this, that sit uh, here, sit here this morning, somebody has some flavor. Mm -hmm. Amen. Somebody Amen. has some salt about them. Yes. That's right. That you are here this morning. That's right. That's right. Amen. Somebody let that light shine enough to get your attention. That's right. right. And the Bible said if the salt had lost its savor, where we shall it be salt? It, it shall be salt. It is this now, born. it is good, good for nothing. nothing. From henceforth, Amen. It is good for nothing. But to be cast if out, you don't stand up and be a light to everyone else. If you don't stand up, and do the yes. right thing. Good then man. the salt, then you become good for nothing. Amen. Why are you here? Yes. Can you explain to me the purpose why God brought you here? Why are you here? Amen. Why are you here? What is the purpose of bringing you here? Be different if you don't understand, they chose you to be different. Yeah. Mm -hmm. right. Amen. Chose you to be a light to everybody else. Amen. It's good for nothing. Amen. But what is good for? For nothing. Mm -hmm. To but be what cast out. To be cast out. out. Oh, it, 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 in other words, you're no good. When something's no good, you get rid of it. All of us, nature subject to some things. Amen. Things that we have in our house is no good to us no more, we get rid of it. Amen. That's right. We consider it to be yeah. waste. Yeah. The light bulb go out. The light bulb go out. You don't keep the light bulb. No. You get rid of it because it's good for nothing. Amen. You take it out of it, out of it, the, the socket, and you throw it in the trash can. Right. Amen. Because Amen. why? It's, it, it's good. It's good for nothing now. Right. It's served no purpose. 
Amen. When it's dark, it's not going to work. Amen. When you hit the switch, it should come on. But when that bulb is out, brother, it's out. And it's good for nothing. You get rid of it. But aren't you glad when you're able to reach and get a bulb? Yeah. That you know it, it works? Yeah. Other day, my wife and I was in my office. And I hit that switch and that lightning come on. And I looked up at the shelf. And then I had some bulbs. And I took that bad bulb out and put it in the trash can and put a new bulb in it and turned it on. And you know what? It gave light to me and my wife. Amen. You can be in here. You can be good for nothing. Good for nothing. Amen. Amen. We tell them, we show them about how they ought to be, but you show them something else. Now, how are they going to work? How are they going to work? How are they going to work? Bible says, every kingdom divided against the seven cannot stand. Even in a house, a husband and wife, they didn't get along. That house ain't going to stand. It ain't going to stand. It's not going to stand if the husband gets the wife, the wife against the husband. It won't stand. Some of you that don't have your companion with you today. You here, but your companion's not here. Why? It couldn't stand. Amen. Amen. You want to serve God, do what's right to do. Your companion don't want to do what's don't right to do. do. It. It's hard to remain in a house like that. Amen. 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 I'm looking at a brother, he, his wife ain't with him. Look at that sister, his, his, her husband's not with her. Another sister, her husband's not with her. It's very, very hard. That's why the Bible says brother and sister is not under such bondage. Look at another sister. My daughter and her husband is not with her. It's hard for, for Beret to live in that her, her in the same house with Beret. When she's trying to do the right thing, he won't do the wrong thing. That's right. It's very hard. Yes. Amen. That's right. Amen. That's very hard. It's, it's, it's almost, it's just, the it's, Bible says much as lies with him, you little piece and try to live peaceful with all men. And sometimes it gets so difficult, you got to get out. That's right. That's the plain truth. Oh, y'all listen to me this morning. Amen. I'm about, about, about to let y'all go, but y'all listening to me this morning. Amen. Amen. Yes, but a brother and sister who's talking about God, the Bible says it's not under such bondage. Brother, you in here? Sister, you in here? Y'all both in here this way? Y'all, a family ship, a husband and wife, this this way, should understand what the Spirit is saying. Amen. It should be amen. amen. I said all the people say it. Amen. Not some of them, all of the people say it. Amen. Not some of the people. I don't even say some of the people say amen. They said all the people say it. Amen. You hear that? No reason. I mean, if you're going to bury you might as well say amen. If you're not going to do that, then why are you here? That's another person there for you. What did you come out to see? A reed shaking in a wing. Man in nice, calm and clothes. But if you come to hear a prophet, then you'll hear more than a prophet. In other words, God's going to talk to you. You'll hear more than a prophet. God is going to talk to you. He's going to tell you what you ought to do. One more, one more chapter. I know one more chapter. Go, 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 go to Hebrews right quick, too. Thank you, We're ending on this. A couple verses and we're ended. Come on. Two, forget that. Because I'm on my mind. I'm going to throw it out there. And we'll let y'all go eat y'all food. Amen. Hebrews 2, what it says there? Hebrews 2 and 1. What? Listen. Therefore. Listen to it. Hebrews 2. Therefore. We ought to give. This is what we ought to do. Yes. This is what we ought to do. Yes. Yes. So I ain't going to do it. Well, you ought to do it. That's right. Amen. But I'm not. Well, you ought to do it. That's right. Amen. Hallelujah. But I'm just not going to do it. Yeah, but you ought to do this here. That's right. Amen. Therefore, we ought to give. The more earnest he is. We ought to give. Yes. Yes. This, this is what you ought to do. Hallelujah. It'll bring help to your bone. Yes. That's right. It'll bring strength to you. Yes. It'll sanctify you. Yes. Give you power over the enemy yes. who yes. seeks to destroy you. That's right. And you know the devil wants you. Yes. Hallelujah. Yeah, you listen to me say, yes. I know Satan wants me. Right. And you know Satan won't do too. Hallelujah. Yes, Hallelujah. Are you listening to me, Satan? So therefore, the Bible says, therefore, we ought to give the more earnest heed to the things to the thing which we have heard. Which we have what? Which we have heard. And the Spirit has spoken to us. Right. And we ought to give the more earnest heed to the thing. What I always say about the dog, you ought to give more earnest heed. What we say about Christmas, you ought to give the more Earnest he, That's you right. ought to do it. Yes. Yes. It may make you sad, but you ought to do it. Yes. 